welcome to this channel i my classes uh, today we will going to discuss that how we can uh, find out that uh, what version of software or what version of os is installed in on ibm i i series machine so uh, let's see what are the possible ways uh, from which we can find out which os version is installed in our i series so for ibm i here so first thing will be uh, like this this is the data area which is actually present in QGPL. QGPL is also present here, but it's always present in QGPL. So if we do the DSP DTARA here, we can see that first six desert of this data area tells us the version of the OS installed on this I series that is IBM OS. So V7, R3, and 0. So the version of uh, OS installed is V7 R3 and 0. Okay. So we can use uh, we can use this data in CL as well to find out uh, the uh, version of the OS here. Another way would be uh, like this one. This is the command which tells about the software resources installed on a system. I see system. So when I press enter here typing this command I press enter so here we can see that these are the resources and which are installed on uh, this I series so now here we can see that F11 display library releases so for releases we need to press F11 key here so then we will be able to see the releases v7 r3 v7 r3 this one so this is the version of the os or the these products or resources which are installed in these libraries actually this down so this is the another way first one was the the data area qss1 mri then the second one is this command dsp sfw rsc and the third one would be uh, like we can do dsp objd here display object description so what we'll do since this qss library is shipped with the uh, os so what we'll do we'll uh, find out the details uh, dsp objd information for this qss library so the type would be star lib here because qss is a library so the object type would be star lib here and we'll check the service details here as you can see f4 then f1 display or listing contains the service related attributes for each object so we'll see the service list here we can all uh, now here we can see that system level is v7 r3 and 0 so from here also we can get this information so we can uh, get this in out file out file is support local support is there for this is out file so it will ask for the out file name like a1 in library q I'll see select star from system slash a1. So here we can see that system version is B7R3 and 0. Mm, I 
anything to read. Text description, save command, save size, save volume, save level, system name, the last it is this system version so the version will be v7r3 here so this was the third way dsp objd on qsys library and search for the service details the second way was the dsp sfw rsc command and the first one was the dsp dta ara uh, qss1 mri detail which is present in qgpl actually and the fourth way would be like we can query this file which is present in QSYS2 TCP IP underscore info that is a this this is a catalog file uh, IBM DB2 catalog file so we can also check here the host version this one last one so it contains the OS information so it contain it tells that this is a v7 rcm0 uh, version so from these four ways we can get the OS version installed on, on our IBM i i series so there may be multiple more ways or maybe not or maybe so we have I, I just know these four ways so I uh, I just uh, created a video to tell you that these are the four possible ways from which we can get the host version if you think that you know uh, other ways you can comment out there in my video thank you for watching my video